I'm Captain Kevin Bohannon. We're here in Palm Beach, Florida, about to load the 57 Spencer Bad Company on the ship, heading toward Palma, Mallorca, Spain, where we're gonna pick it up and venture out a thousand miles outside into the Atlantic and end up in Madeira. Fishing there for six, seven weeks, heading to the Azores after that. Basically starting off our world tour right now. <laughs> Offload went terrific and our weather window was, was pretty narrow and, and in fact if we didn't hit certain spots at a certain time we were going to get blown out. And everything was going good, we were making great time and, it, and the weather actually picked up significantly quickly like ahead of schedule so uh, we got into just some pretty good chop. It was like, I don't know, six to eight feet at four seconds. And that boat handled it, but it was not, it's not worth breaking the boat or breaking a crew member. So I decided to, uh, to turn it into this tiny, tiny port that I don't think they've ever seen a boat of our caliber before. Uh, called El Mary Bar Spain. And we waited out weather for for a good 48 hours there and then continued on to Gibraltar. Um, leaving Gibraltar weather was was decent. We had a we were on the tail end of like a cutoff low that, that allowed us to literally sneak by it. I could see the low raising up the coast and the wind line. We had some pretty good swells. It was like 10 feet in 13 seconds, with maybe like two to three foot on top of that. Uh, winds never got over 20 knots, so big rolling seas and, and strong wind, but that boat handled it was nice. Just um, getting ready to leave for Madeira today. Um, we had a slight delay with our uh, COVID cases. Um, but yeah, as you can see, everything's all strapped down now. We spent the last few days getting ready for the crossing. Um, we're hoping 10 to 12 days. Um, there is a little bit of weather behind us, so that's why we're kind of pushing to get out today, uh, just to stay ahead of it all. Yeah, we're leaving today, looking forward to getting over to Europe and seeing what sort of produce they have over there and fresh ingredients. And yeah, see, see how it goes. Goodbye, goodbye!
we wanted to leave earlier, obviously, but um, we had we had some crew get COVID, uh, so we had to hang around Florida, get everyone healthy, and um, then we just got right into the heart of you know hurricane season. So uh, we bombed over 12 days, 12 knots or so. Um, yeah, it was surreal. It's one of those things where it felt like you hadn't been there that long, but also felt like you'd been there for three years. We got plenty of fuel, plenty of speed, plenty of range to uh, go over. We got to go, and uh, we're ready to travel the world on this thing and not look back. I'm just pumped. I haven't been to I only been to Madeira once, and I chartered a boat, so I've been wanting to fish here all my life, and it's it's happening. You know these hundreds of, of 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 hours and a lot of funding and lots of chaos, lots of planning. Tomorrow is it. The boys have been um, scouting the last couple of days. Uh, the Spencer has a full Omni, full bait system, Sea Keeper Gyro. It's equipped to the hilt, and um, we're uh, we're pumped. I'm pumped. I mean, we're we're getting on the getting on the jet now. We're fueled up. It's an eight-hour flight, and we're going straight. When we land, we should be landing around 6:30. Uh, we're going straight to the Spencer, and um, we'll put them in. Wish everybody can come. Fish on, baby. Let's go. A company always on the run. A destiny. The rising sun. I was born a shotgun in my hands. Behind the gun, I'll make my final stand. Yeah, and that's why they call me. Only 170 miles from here. Yeah. No one's heard of it. And nobody's heard, heard of it. Cooler. To discover something. Check, well, check this shit time. out. Yeah. <laughs> this is badass. What's it called? I don't know. But this is it here too. This is the other island. 
That looks too good. That's my bacon. Just uh, kind of a nice one, another 500. It's been one bite, one fish a day, and we're okay with that. <laughs> hey, I just said no more, no more. So one of the things we we really um, we really uh, felt is the overall positive spirit of the people from Madeira. You know, here comes you know quote unquote rich guy with this big boat, but they were they were so authentic and genuine. They were so welcoming. We couldn't have done it without them because of the information they provided us, the logistics, who to go to, who to contact. They were in court, incredibly supportive. So I just decided, hey, you know, to show our appreciation, let's let's do a party. Uh, so Friday night we did a we did a party on the on the 150, and uh, and we threw the long ball out there. And we said, you know what, let's invite the mayor, and he came. He was a lovely man, very nice. He 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 brought gifts for us, so we thought that was pretty nice, but. The local community showed up in, in force, and it was just, uh, you know, they were just very proud of the fact that you know our our world tour kicked off in uh, in Madeira. I was invited to come on board this beautiful, beautiful uh, yacht and this awesome party. The owner has gently invited us to come and is sh sharing with us the taste of being on board a super mega yacht which is equipped with the best uh, of the world for uh, big game fishing. Thank you. It's unreal to be here on this 
it's not real. This is, this is what's something you live in your dreams. Sorry. It's some of the, some of the best things that give you in speechless. I never thought to be here, you know what I mean? I saw you guys on Bad Company for many months. Being here and being on your boat, it's an honor. You guys are the best. You guys are living every fisherman's dream. The best adventure, fishing adventure in the world. Not just now. This will last forever. We're going home. We're gonna do trip number two soon. Thanks for uh, tuning in. And as they say on YouTube, if you like this, click the like button and subscribe all for the sake of War Heroes on Water.